What is up YouTube? Mark here from lowenuniversity.com. This week we're giving away one of the brand new, hot off the press, MXR sub octave fuzz pedals. One of the newest pedal releases from the Dunlop MXR pedal line. This thing was just announced and unveiled at the Summer NAMM show 2017 back in July. And I'm not even sure if these are out. And if they are, they haven't been out for very long. So you can be one of the first to own one of these. Not a lot of people have them yet. So very fortunate and very grateful for Dunlop uh, for partnering with us to do this giveaway. So thank you guys enough. You guys know who you are. Very excited to demo this for you in this video, show you what it sounds like and show you what it's made of. And from what I know, it has an octave uh, segment, a fuzz segment. You can control them independently. You can do them together with lots of flexibility in between. But before we do that, I want to let you know that this giveaway is taking place on Instagram exclusively. So go follow at Low and You on Instagram. We just announced the last week's winner giveaway for the EMG pickups. Congratulations. And if you didn't win, you have three more chances this month to win gear from Warwick, which is an actual streamer bass guitar from their line, a double bass gig bag from Gator Cases. And this week is the MXR sub octave fuzz pedal. So we'll see you over there. And uh, let's check out what this pedal is made of. So to give you a very brief overview of how this pedal works, there's basically two functions that can work independently of one another or they can work together. We have the fuzz and we have the sub octave. Sub octave meaning it's creating an octave below the current octave you're currently playing, okay? And you can use each one independently. So if you don't wanna use the octave function, you can just turn that off and use it like a normal fuzz pedal. There are two different controllable fuzz sounds, which we'll demonstrate here shortly. Very different and very cool, okay? And if you don't want any fuzz, you can purely use this like a sub octave normal pedal with no fuzz. You can work that in here. We obviously have our dry signal, which we can work in the normal dry signal. Okay, no dry signal or a lot of dry signal. So a lot of flexibility here. And the gain is sort of the input gain here, which controls sort of the fuzz side. You can obviously turn this entire pedal off with the bypass function. And if you don't want to use any of the octave, you can obviously turn it off or you can turn it off completely here with the toggle switch. Now, before we play, let me explain how this EQ works. It's very interesting. And I think uh, Dunlop and MXR really thought this through. So while we have a bass, treble, and mid EQ cut and boost, you'll notice that they're on either side of the pedal. So the bass and the treble actually control the cut and boost of the fuzz signal. So not the dry signal. However, the mid-range EQ actually does cut and boost for the dry signal. This is very interesting because in my experience, sometimes when you kick on the fuzz pedals or any sort of effect pedal, the mid-range takes a hit. So it's almost like you can work back in that lost mid-range here on your dry signal, which, you, which helps you to retain the low end and sort of retain the pure signal, while the fuzz sort of can be reproduced with a lot of you know treble. We want that sort of trebly, gnarly sound but to give it some low end fuzz too. And we can work all of that in very beautifully here with the octave function. And all in all, just a lot of flexibility with this pedal. Um, I think it's gonna be really groundbreaking for lots of effects. And the cool thing is you can use each one independently without the other if you want to. So let's check out how it sounds. Thank you. 